Yo, what's up, critiquer? Click, click. So, checking out some more treasure here. This is the other song that they released called Come To Me. They released uh, somewhat of a music video, I guess. It's called a selfie version. <laughs> I guess it's just a smash up of a bunch of different Instagram posts or something. I don't know. But we don't know this song yet. We're going to break down the lyrics afterwards. See what the content is. Let's go. Okay, I like the look. Fast flows. Versus, you know me, I'm a hip hop head, so like, I enjoyed the rap more. It was very, it was very bop. It was very rhythmic. You know what I'm saying? Had a nice, had a nice bop to it. Um, it was a little poppy at parts, and personally, I didn't, I didn't enjoy the extreme pop at some parts. But I do feel like the verses, the rap verses, really complemented the song a lot for me. From my ear, I liked it more when the verses were on. But let's check out these lyrics and see what they're talking about. I did really like Asahi in the beginning. Mm 
내가 더 밤이 떠올라 네가 댁했던 말들이 괴로워 너무 착했던 널 보니 서러워 뒤로 백백 돌아가 돌려놔 내가 못 날긴 좀못 날지 너무 서툰 것 같아 역시 나갈 때도 나같이 네가 잘못한 거야 oh, oh. Like the flows and the, the key changes and stuff it's reminding me of like disco Doesn't it sound like a little disco-ish? Yeah So so far they're talking about a love that they lost and that they wish that they could have back. In case I get further away, I'm afraid quite a lot. Like I'm afraid that I'm gonna get further away from being with you again. Like it's never gonna happen. I remember the night I texted and you know, I texted you trying to reach out to you saying I miss you or whatever. And the things that you said back pained me. Like I wish that you felt the same way that I do, but you don't. So it upsets me. Right, let's keep going. This is about waiting for a girl, like literally just like, just like saying like, I, I want you more than anybody. You know what I'm saying? You might not be ready for me. You might not want me right now, but hey, I'm still gonna love you. Which honestly, to me, is kind of corny. Like just let that shit go. Like screw her, bro. <laughs> don't be sitting here loving somebody that don't want you back. None of that, none of that. Okay, I really liked Haruto's wordplay here, his little rhyme scheme here. It sounds pretty good. <laughs> I would try my best to forget everything and laugh, baby. Ah. Listen, bro, you don't gotta do that. Screw this. Screw that. <laughs> Screw that chick. Or whoever it is. Whoever keeps saying whatever. So that's literally saying that all my friends are telling me to just let it go. You know, my friends keep saying whatever, whoever keeps saying whatever, everyone's telling me I shouldn't be with you, but I'm just not gonna listen to them, I'm just gonna love you no matter what. <laughs> What does he say here? I'll, I'll rub you clean till your everything is shining white. Oh, that's pretty metaphorical. I like that. So like, you know what I'm saying? I'll rub you clean like it, like you look like you're not dirty at all. Like I'll pretty much brainwash myself. So everything I see in you is beautiful, which that's crazy. Like, You can really relate to that if you've ever been with somebody that, you know, you can see their flaws, but you just want to be like, nah, like, I don't see that. 
You know what I mean? Like, so you just don't pay attention to that. Especially if this person uh, you can't trust. Yeah, this is probably my favorite part of the track right here. I really like the way Hunsa came in to this verse. Um, the auto tune really sounds good on his voice. See that his rhyme schemes is really, really nice here. Hyun Suk is talking about, you know, I can fall asleep easy because I know I'm gonna see you in my dreams. So hey, just being Romeo, lovey dovey, Hyun Suk. Aww. <laughs> Ah. I really like that. Not bad. I like the disco feel a little bit, you know. Got a little disco feel to it. I definitely think they can do better though. You know, I, I don't think this is gonna be my favorite by them. Something about it, I think needs just a little bit something. I don't know, you know, maybe the song will grow on me a little bit, but at this moment, it's not like astounding to me. Their voices and you know, I can't complain about how they sound or anything like that. I think it's just the track itself. You know what I mean? I think somebody else would enjoy it more than me. I thought the content was, you know, it was cute and sweet. If uh, one of my friends felt like this way, though, I would tell him to just cut that freaking bad apple off. You know what I'm saying? Screw that. Screw that. I liked it at parts more than others. Yeah. More. That's what I feel. There's a bob. Like, there, there was some moments that just didn't resonate with me, but then there were some moments I was like, ooh. I don't know. I still think this group is very strong. They're amazing dancers. If you haven't seen them dance yet, they are phenomenal at dancing. None of them sound bad to me. All of them have great tones. You know, my favorite personally is still Yadam. And I'm really a fan of Hun Suk. Like, he's a great rapper. So, I'm hyped to check out some more, man. I'm ready for some more treasure. Definitely want to check out some more covers, too. You guys really want me to check out those so let me know what's next thanks for critiquing with us guys if you like this video i appreciate if you give the video a like stay tuned for some more and stay classy world critic out Shine out